And for our fans, they're just crazy people anyway. I always look at people in a Green Day shirt, and I think what's wrong with that person? What kind of hang-ups does that person have? Obviously it's not just the catchy songs it goes deeper than that. The thing is, my education was music. I knew I'd be playing music no matter what. That's all I thought about, I was obsessed with it. I'm still obsessed with it. It gets the best of me sometimes. I think everybody should get married. Boys and girls. Girls and boys. Boys and boys. Girls and girls. Shouldn't we all be entitled to a family civil rights baby it's civil rights. It doesn't get any better here in Berkeley I'll tell you that. Punk rock isn't supposed to be for everyone. There is that sort of private club mentality, which is necessary. It keeps things from getting watered down and boring. Just seeing the things on TV and the things in front of you, the amount of information coming in, and the lack of information not coming in, how could you not help but write songs about it? That's where all good music comes from, I think, anything that's likely to have an impact on pop culture comes from a point where there's no expectation of it becoming anything other than personal. Just because you sing songs about a certain feeling doesn't mean you have to go feeling that way forever. You can sing about that for the rest of your life. But that doesn't mean things aren't going to change in your own life. The first time that you escape from home or the small town that you live in, there's a reason a small town is called a small town, it's because not many people want to live there. Controversy want controversy this is reality. What I see is that no matter if you're a conservative or a liberal or whatever side you stand on, this is the reality of the situation, that people's families and their young kids are being affected. Set lists are tough because you come up with this structure of how the songs are going to go from one to the next, but at the same time, you have to be spontaneous and take requests and change the set list at the drop of a hat. The things that people do now in sports, you can't even believe. These are complete total athletes. To see what human beings can do in the highest level is amazing. There are a lot of bands who claim to be punk and they only play the music. They have no clue what it's all about. It's a lifestyle. It's not about popularity and all that crap. A guy walks up to me and asks, what's punk? So I kick over a garbage can and say, that's punk. So he kicks over the garbage can and says, that's punk? And I say, no that's trendy. I think people are born bisexual, and it's just that our parents and society kind of veer us off into this feeling of oh, I can't. They say it's taboo. It's ingrained in our heads that it's bad, when it's not bad at all. It's a very beautiful thing. I don't feel any shame I won't apologize if there ain't nowhere you can go running away from pain when you've been victimized tales from another broken home. You know, when I first started listening to punk rock music, I used to get my fucking ass kicked for it. I was known as a fucking freak. But now I'm amongst many 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 freaks here with me tonight. It's okay to grow up, it's just slowing down that's the scary part. Running out of time. It's okay to grow up, but it doesn't mean you have to become like your parents. 
Sometimes I need to apologize, sometimes I need to admit that I ain't right, sometimes I should just keep my mouth shut, or only say hello, sometimes I still feel I'm walking alone. Minority is about being an individual. It's like you have to sit through the darkness to find your place and be that individual you want to be your entire life. 